Now, with all that being said, it's time to take a look at the winter outlook. And we've got all the data we need from the Climate Prediction Center of the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration, or NOAA. They take a look at temperature and precipitation over the months of December, January, and February and give us some idea of what we might expect during those months uh, during the winter. So take a look at Colorado on temperature. We're split in half with the western part of the state, southern part of the state, slightly above normal, meaning warmer temperatures for the winter. Northern Colorado, Denver, and the Eastern Plains, near normal. And in a near normal winter, we could see bouts of cold air coming in. Now let's take a look at the water content and the precipitation. In the wintertime, it is mostly snow. So most of the state is predicted to be normal. And since we're having a weak La Nina year, that means several different things for several different communities here. You could see that below patch down there in Southern Colorado. So the bottom line in a weak La Nina year, most of the storms come in from the northwest. So northern Colorado could have an above normal year on snowfall. Denver and the eastern plains more near normal and southern Colorado a little less precipitation pushing up in the San Juans and the Sangre de Cristos.